Hey folks, today we have a few really cool math tricks for you. You won't need a calculator for these and they'll definitely impress your teacher. Let's go. Number five, the multiplication trick. If you want to multiply numbers with a maximum of two digits, then this trick is awesome. Let's say our numbers are 21 and 34. First, let's see how many tens go into 21. Of course, 10 goes in twice. So first we calculate 10 times 34. That's 340. Since 10 goes in two times, we add 340 to 340 and get 680. Now comes the one and the 21. One times 34 is 34. Now we just add that to the 680 and get the solution, 714. Number four, multiplying by 11. If you want to multiply a two digit number by 11, then you can just do it with this trick in five seconds. Our task is 36 times 11. Just add the three and the six and write the result nine between the three and the six. Now you have the number 396. Ta-da, that's the solution. It actually is that easy. Number three, the nine finger trick. Do you still remember the nine finger trick? For this trick, it's actually very simple to use your fingers. Turn both your palms inwards. Now start from left to right and always flip a finger and ta-da. You can see the nine series right in front of you. Here's an example. Put the third finger on your left hand down and count three times nine. On the left side of your folded finger, you have two fingers, so 20. And to the right of that finger, there's seven, so 27. Three times nine is 27. Want another example? Put the seventh finger down and try to figure out seven times nine. On the left, you now have six, so 60, and on the right, three, so 63 in total. Seven times nine is 63. Pretty cool, huh? Number two, multiplying by five. No matter what number you have, you can easily multiply by five incredibly quickly if you know the right trick. 5 is half of 10, so we can make it easy and just multiply by 10. Our example number is 45. 45 times 10 is 450. Since we want to multiply by 5, all we have to do is take 450 into two parts and get the solution of 225. Quite simple, right? And last but not least, number 1, calculating percent. Even most percentages can be easily calculated with a simple trick, which is usually sufficient for everyday life. For example, if there's a 25% off everything sale, then you want to buy something for 35 euros, then we'll calculate first the 10% off. At 35, that would be 3.5 euros. Now we continue to the 20 of the 25%. And we can easily calculate that 3.5 plus 3.5 equals 7 euros. So for the last 5%, all we need to do is cut in half one of those 3.5s and we get 1.75. Add that to the 7 euros and you get 8 euros and 75 cents. <coughs> So if you're getting a 25% discount on 35 euros, that means you're saving 8 euros and 75 cents. Pretty easy. Okay folks, well I hope these math tricks help you. If you like this video, why not check out another one here. Until next time, bye.